Man, something smells good in here. You cooking Brussels sprouts? No, I just farted. That checks out. What do you mean? Come on, you think the fat man's gonna figure out those clues? He's an idiot. Yeah, I guess you're right. Yes, I mean, he's the guy who put all those little bald men in incubators because he thought they were babies. Look at you. You came early, but you're gonna make it. I'm a senior vice president at an investment firm. Oh, someone's a fussy britches. Maybe if she spent some time on the treadmill and I was drunk. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't either. Hey, this is a lot of fun for everybody. Do you mind if I upstage you at your job? Attention, everybody. This is your captain. I'm not going to turn on the fasten seatbelt sign. You guys can do whatever you want. Now I get it. I'm sorry I played your saxophone. All right. Shouldn't be too hard to get ourselves kicked out. Right. We've just got to convince them we're not army material. Ready? All right, let's do it. Mm -hmm. Wow, look at how gay we are. I am so gay with my gayness. Me too. I'm... I'm a homo. Any room for one more? Hell yeah! Brian, do you really think Loretta is beautiful? Absolutely. That's really how I feel. Now, it is true her personality is abrasive. Slightly abrasive. But overall, Loretta is a delightful person, very pleasant to be around, and free to pursue a life of religious fulfillment. I believe this, Joe. This is like living in Russia. I might as well just move there. You don't want to do that. It's dark, it's cold, and hooking up is just a crapshoot because of all the big coats. All right, drop the coats on three. One, two, three. Oh. Yeah. Husband and wife, you may kiss the bride. I'm glad we waited. Giraffity! Yeah, see, that's not mine. Can't desecrate a child's grave. Don't worry, Lois. We're gonna do it with reverence. Hey, how about a little digging song? <laughs> little Peter Griffin digging up a casket, shovel full of dirt, and <clears throat> pop me on the head. I didn't care for the end of that song. Oh, my God. The treasure's in the casket. Come on, Meg, let's get it! My treasure! Oh, Peter. Hi, dear. Oh, oh. Let's do some role-playing. You're you, and I'm Peter, only with much worse knees. Ow, my knees! Uh, actually, Peter, I think I finally want to make love to a 1950s spaceman. Really? You mean it? All right, let's go. <laughs> Good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is our thing. We're not sharing this with anyone. Peter, come on. Are you serious? If Joe or I found this, we'd want you right alongside us. Oh, yeah. We're like peas in a pod. Wait, wait, don't go in there. He's doing his podcast. Oh, that's cute. Now that I like. What do you think about this, you old bag? Oh, no. Hi, Mr. Herbert. Oh, my God. Children, run. It's that pervert. Everybody into my safety basement. Oh, oh, that was a bad snap. I'm hurt, kids. Don't eat those popsicles till I get down there. Where the hell am I? Oh, my God, I'm in the wrong Korea. That's it. Like your missiles, I'm about to go ballistic. <laughs> but that's not how it really happened. That's it. Like your missiles, I'm about to go ballistic. Ow! A northern bird flew into my nuts. Oh, go to commercial. Wait a minute. There might be a way out of this. What? We just talked to the guy who got us into this. He'll know what to do. Chris, check it out. Jackass number two. Not sure. You gonna buy a cookie this time? Oh, I better just stick with the sample. I'm so bad. But at least I know I'm bad, so that makes me a little less bad. Or worse. <laughs> That was the right thing to do. Boy, I can't wait to lay into that recruiter. Yes, you'll be about as effective as the Wizard of Oz was at granting wishes. And, Dorothy, you wanted herpes. But little did you know, you've had herpes all along. I didn't want herpes. Oh. Well, you've got it. Need the 50 bucks. Damn it, I knew I shouldn't have named that star for Mort. Ugh, just give me the money. 
Now we'll never know what's behind the last box on the M&M advent calendar. It's M&M's, Peter. They've all been M&M's. You don't know that! You ate my whole family, you fat bastard. One more day. Hey, Brian, sorry about the sling. I got shot by an M&M. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, look. Everybody but Chris, just keep your pants on and let's figure a way out of this. Oh, man. Um, this sucks worse than when I went to that strip club without Lois. Yay! Pedal faster! I can't go any faster! Where are you going, kids? Hey, I just want to talk to you. Why don't you come over to my place for a glass of wine and a couple of fruit pies, and then we can go in the back room and play Crazy Snakes. Hee 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 Brian? We're pregnant. Oh, my God. And in 18 years, he's going to move away. Yes, I'll take this teddy bear, this ruler, this piece of string, and this cardboard box. Mmm. Sounds like you need a roommate. Where'd you get that kind of money? I picked up Chris's paper route. Oh, gosh, 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 it's a brand new paper boy. That's a mighty full sack you're carrying. Piss off, you perverted old freak. Oh, we got a fighter. So I guess Thanos got the Mind Stone. Wow, so now he's got all of them. I guess so. What does that mean for us? I have no idea. I knew it was gonna be us. What did you say, Chris? Uh, nothing, I'm sorry. Chris, I will not have your comic strip anger cluttering up my house. It's negative and it ruins my joy. Get it out of here. Now you've done it. You've made me 1930s work whistle angry! Now that I see what it is, I'm ashamed of myself. I hope you can find it in your heart. Hey, Bri. There's a good girl. Oh, because I've tried everything. Counting sheep, thinking sleepy thoughts. I even hired the Sandman. Sand and sand and sand and sand and sand and sand and good night! Santa Claus? Why are you taking our Christmas tree? Why are you in pigtails in a little girl's nightgown? Okay, okay. Maybe we both forget what we saw. This place is like a ghost town half the time. Yeah, uh, maybe somebody should have asked me. After all, I'm the only one in this family with any business experience. All right, Violet and Pigpen, you've been seeing each other a few weeks now. What seems to be the problem? I keep getting bladder infections, and I don't know why. Really? You don't know why? All I'm saying is you're being used and you're too clueless to know it. Well, you just think you're so superior, don't you? Like that first creature to walk on dry land. Hey, where'd you go? I went for a jog. What's a jog? It's a great way to stay in shape is what it is. Is it like a swim? Uh, uh, <laughs> no, no, it's, it's nothing like a swim. I've got this, my friend. This is when that slick cucumber deep inside of me comes out. Oh, okay. You're gonna hate me, but I really need to take this. Don't you dare! But it might be Bruce Lee finally calling to admit that I'm the best at Kung Fu! This is your one chance, Stewie. I will not call you a...